good afternoon. Thank you for coming to this um, new location for our news conference. Clearly we didn't meet yesterday, but we had some important announcements that we wanted to make today. And then there's a strategic, per strategic reason why we are in this location. So I will let the mayor take over. We'll take just a few questions at the very end. All right. Good afternoon. Thank you for joining us for our weekly press briefings. Uh, everybody was out on holiday for Monday, and so uh, that is why we're here on a fine Tuesday. Uh, thank the Lord for this beautiful weather, uh, for us having this press, press conference. And we're right here on the corner of Ridgeway and Park, uh, Parkway Street. Uh, because this is one of the locations that the city of Jackson uh, just paved one of our neighborhood streets. Uh, we told you that we were going to have uh, a paving season and we told you that we were starting to go into neighborhoods. And we started in the process by talking to community members, talking to neighborhood associations, understanding what were the streets, the thoroughfares that were most important to them. And so this is one of the many streets, uh, sorry, Channel 12, <laughs> uh, this is one of the many streets that was in the A1 uh, phase of our street repaving uh, in the city of Jackson. And so in this A1, uh, which was paved, paved and paid for by the city's 1% sales tax money, this is money which represents the shared sacrifice of our residents. I brag on Jacksonians all the time because I can think of no other place where people are so in tune with the improvement of their city that they're willing to take additional sacrifice on their own ha behalf to pay an extra penny on the goods and services that they buy. And so we want you to know that your money is going to good use. In addition to this road that we're on right here on the corner of Ridgeway and Parkway, a part of the A uh, A1 phase of this street resurfacing, more to come, but in this initial phase, we've already paved Main Street between Ridgeway Street and Walter Dutch Welch Drive. Parkway Street, as we mentioned, where we're here at the Ridgeway and Walter Dutch Drive uh, connection. Avenue G, Avenue H, James O. Glass Drive, Holmes Avenue, Ashdown Street, Aurora Street, Brain Bridge Drive, uh, Alder Marble, uh, Alder, Alder Marble, Nar Marl, uh, sorry, Arbor Marble Road, uh, Eminence Road, Lawson Street, Cottage Street, Marion Dunbar Street, Ridgeway Street, and James Hill Street, just to name a few of the streets that are a part of the A1 phase of this paving. And there are many more streets to come. Uh, I would be spending the, the majority, or if not the entirety, of the rest of this press conference just listing the streets that we're going to be doing. You will see us on location as we continue to do these paving projects. Uh, we invited members of the commission. Granted, we did it in a, um, it was kind of late notice to them today, but we will be giving them advance notice in the future so that they can be a part of uh, these projects and the acknowledgement to the residents that their money is going to work, is being put to use in a way in which they have been a part of the process to inform us of where their priorities lie. And so that's where uh, we are, that's why we are here on Ridgeway uh, Street and Parkway, because we want you to see the work that is being accomplished. I'm going to turn the page after we, yeah, I thank them. I'm gonna turn the page and go to a couple of other